The narcissist is not done with you yet. It may seem like it's over. It may seem like the narcissist has moved on with their lives. But narcissists do not move on that easily. They cannot deal with the thought of you moving on without them. With all of the qualities and abilities that you possess. With your mental and emotional health. Where you could rebuild everything that they tried to destroy. Where you could meet someone who will treat you right. The narcissist cannot allow that to happen. Because that would reflect badly on them. It would make them feel inadequate. As though they were not good enough for you. When they want to create this narrative that you are not good enough for them. Which is not something that would happen on its own. They have to be the cause of it. They have to create conditions that make it difficult for you to perform. Where it seems like you are deficient in something. And that is why the narcissist is not done with you. They cannot allow you to move on with everything that makes you who you are. Because that makes them look bad. It reveals to everyone who the problem is. Because if you're so bad. How could you move on and do better without them? It wouldn't make any sense. It would reveal to people that the narcissist was the problem all along. But the narcissist's image of reputation is very important to them. So they will do whatever it takes to protect it. For the narcissist to protect their false self, it means that they have to destroy you. Because it's clear that there was a problem in the relationship. It's clear that something was wrong. So someone must have been the cause of it. Someone has to be responsible. And they want to make it look like something is wrong with you. They want to make you look like you're crazy. But a functioning person who can provide for themselves does not look crazy at all. Which is why they have to destroy everything that makes you who you are. They have to reduce it to dust. Because then their narrative is more believable. Which is why the narcissist is not done with you yet. Because if you were to move on as you are, it would make them look bad. It would make it look like something is wrong with them. It would make it look like they were the problem. The narcissist is not done with you yet. They're not done with you. Because they still want something from you. You have what they want. It could be supply. It could be money or a place to stay. Whatever it is, they want it. And that is why they cannot leave you alone. Narcissists are sore losers. They hate to lose. They cannot deal with the thought that they might be missing out on something. 
once they have invested their time and energy into you, they believe that everything you have belongs to them. So they're not going to move on. At least not until they get a piece of the pie. Because in their minds they have earned it. In their minds they have worked for it. Narcissists are arrogant and entitled. They really believe that you should just hand it over to them. And if you don't, they're going to be lurking around for a long time. Narcissists come into the relationship with nothing and often leave with everything. While the victim comes into the relationship with everything and often leaves with nothing. The narcissist cannot deal with the thought of leaving a relationship with exactly what they came in with or even if they only made a small gain. They see a relationship as a job. As though they should be paid for any time they spend with you. As though you should see it as a privilege to be around them. Even though they make your life hell, in their minds you should see it as an honour. Narcissists do not enter relationships to build anything. They enter relationships to steal your tools and resources so that they can use it to build something for themselves. They come into relationships only to take, only for their own benefit. And that is why the narcissist is not done with you. Because they're not finished extracting what they want from you. They can see that you still have more to give. The final discard occurs only when you have nothing or when they've decided that they've got enough. The narcissist is not done with you yet. They're not finished with you because they still want something. Because they see that you still have something to give. As long as you have something, the relationship can continue. Or if you refuse to be with them, they will hold on to you for dear life. Because you are their lifeline. That's what you were when they first met you. And that's what you are when the relationship ends. You're just something that they depend on for a means of escape from their difficult situation. You're just something that they use to preserve themselves without any consideration for you. Which is why they will step on you to get ahead. They will run you into the ground so that they can get what they want. Because that's the only reason why they got involved with you. So that they could get what they want. They knew that you had it. And when you try to move on. They look at it like you're taking something which rightfully belongs to them. Because they see you and everything you have as their property. They see it as though you belong to them. And if you want to leave... You have to pay the price. You have to pay compensation. Because they're always the victims. And in their minds, they have suffered.
when you reject a narcissist, it causes a narcissistic injury. And after that, they're going to want revenge. When they targeted you, they felt like they had everything. But when you're no longer under their spell and you leave them, they feel like they've lost everything. So now they want to make you feel the same way. They want to make you lose everything, even though you are not responsible for what happened to them. They lied to you, they deceived you, but the narcissist will not take accountability for anything. In their minds, they were treated unfairly. And that is why they're not done with you. That is why they're going to keep coming back. That is why they're going to be a constant reminder in your life of the mistake you made. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonates with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching.narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.